Smack in the middle of 9th Avenue between 18th and 19th Street sits Stone Street Coffee. Dave is the owner. The community loves it. That they walk their dogs. They, they have their kids. They don't have to come all the way inside. They just come up to the window, grab their coffee, and continue on their way. Elena has been working here for years and knows customers by name. Even remembered mine. And I haven't been here in three years. Made with love. They get busy, really busy, and have a whole lot of supplies. We have a small coffee shop, but we were getting so busy, we needed a place to keep all our coffee beans and all our milk and all our cups and everything. So we come next door. Okay, let's go next door. I'm taking the coffee cup. Bye. Bye, everybody. We come in here. This is this is where you. So this is where we store our coffee. We keep our coffee beans, our bags, an extra machine, all our stuff inside here. But looks can be deceiving, and that door right there. Well, that's the real reason we're here. Our host then escorts them in the buzzer and brings them into another bar. And then you come through the curtain. Welcome to the 18th room, named appropriately after the 18th Amendment, which prohibited alcohol during Prohibition. Hence why the space hides behind a coffee shop. And its menu is a newspaper. We could keep it more to a limited capacity and keep the volume at a, at a minimum. So this is only seated? Seated only. For Chelsea residents who know the storefront, this used to be a hair salon. They actually kept the exterior the exact same, but made big changes to the inside. Some people who were walking by saying, like, what's in, why All is the there time, coffee yeah. in the window here? People ask, they, they walk in, they look, they say, is this another coffee shop or what's going on? And while bespoke cocktails are their jam, and then a Koval gin, they use relatively unknown alcohol brands that are all environmentally friendly in how they're made. Brendan has been doing sustainable cocktails and been running bars for over 10 What's years. What's a sustainable cocktail? So it's about being conscious about the environment. I like that. Uh, we have a no waste policy, so we use ingredients in multiple drinks and, and food. Brandon, the bartender, moved here all the way from Australia where he perfected this concept. Do you treat these like works of art? It's more about making sure sustainability is at the forefront and also that you know, every drink that's going out is delicious and you're getting your money's worth. So all the, all the labor goes in before we even open. And I'd say he's a pro. This is the winner. This is the winner. Yeah. This is great. This is my jam.